Gemini, this is your general love reading for the week beginning February 20th. You have the hanged man, the lovers, three of swords, the ace of pentacles, Strength card, the Four of Cups, Justice, the Nine of Cups, the Empress, but the overall energy for the reading is the Five of Cups. And I'm going to clarify a couple of things here. Okay. Hmm. So right now you're in a situation where your love life is a big challenge. So it's either that you're trying to make a decision about someone or um, the relationship that you had with somebody is broken now and you are definitely in a period of mourning, um, very sad and you're focused on this so much that it's interfering with other things in your life you clearly loved somebody deeply and they let you down it didn't work out um, they definitely broke your heart and You're not feeling too good about it. I do see that with you in, a, in this sort of position, it's like there's no movement. You're not using your energy to make a change for yourself. And that could be part of your issue right now. Um, I feel like there's you're in a situation where you feel like it's kind of like it's Groundhog Day every day. I feel like the same thing. It's like I'm stuck in this endless loop of things just constantly being the same every day, every day. I do the same thing and it's kind of like when am I ever going to, you know, if it's a merry-go-round, when am I going to get off of it? Um, and you feel like you've been in this for a while. This, this cycle has been... Um, giving you a tough time for, I would say, at least eight, seven, eight, nine months, maybe. Uh, maybe not for all of you, but you're strong, Gemini. You are very strong. You can handle this. And I feel like once you, you remind yourself of how strong you are, that you can take on anything that comes against you. Um, you may even feel like the person that hurt you, they also hurt your reputation. Um, and... You just feel, I mean, you even have the Four of Cups. You just feel like, you know, I don't want just one little cup, you know. I'm not, I'm not interested in that. I want big love. I want to be the center of somebody's attention. But you can get there. You can get there. You can get there. You can have the Nine of Cups. 
at the um, outcome of the situation, I see these two cards. So you can have the happy life, the successful life. You can have um, a person in your life who is an equal, but it's going to take some work. And right now, you're going to have to look at things in a different way, first of all. Then you're going to have to get to work. You're going to have to accept either working, something literally that you're working on, um, Maybe maybe focus a little bit more on your job right now because there is an offer there. Uh, but don't feel like you're going to be let down in love always. You're not. There's definitely changes coming in. Um, justice will be served and you don't have to worry about doing that. It, let, let karma take care of the person that hurt you. Uh, Because you can be happy. You can have this Nine of Cups. And you can have the Emperor and the Empress. And it's all going to begin with just one conversation. With just one new beginning. Um, you know, taking the next step. And starting a conversation with somebody. But you've got to get out of this mindset that... Um, you know, I don't want just anybody. I want what I had. I want, you know, the person I had. I don't want to be let down. And I just, I'm sick and tired of this cycle that I've been on. Because that's really how you feel. I mean, you feel dark. You feel like you deserve better things. You feel like things could be different. And, like, you feel like you're you're just frustrated. You're in this locked position where you can't can't get unstuck but all of these things feel like I think in a way it's like you're going to reinvent yourself you're going to you're going to become this person from this person right now you don't have the strength to get down right now you don't have the strength to make any movement but you're going to gain strength. And I feel like that's coming in the next couple of months for you. But once you make that movement, you gain that strength, you're going to work toward your happiness. You're going to have conversations with somebody. There's going to be a new spark, like a new beginning with someone that will ultimately lead to this, which is pretty amazing considering that you feel disappointed right now. Thank you.